Welcome to 69.5 Everything Sports. I'm Chase Stevens. I have my co-hosts, Chris and Eric. And today's topic, if you were to start a franchise in the NFL with only players under 25, who are you building around? Chris, we'll have you start. I mean, it's it's obvious. Justin Jefferson, the best receiver in the league. I mean, like, there's no one else you can pick to be a better option for this. I mean, over 1,800 yards last season, over 1,600 year before, and over 1,400 his rookie year. I mean, there's nobody better. I, I disagree. I think if you got to start your franchise around somebody, I think I would choose a quarterback. And that quarterback, I think I would choose Jalen Hurts. Just seeing what he did this year, leading that team to the Super Bowl after a really off year. And then coming back the next year and just being a phenomenal player and leading his team to the Super Bowl where he had an outstanding performance, I think I would choose Dalen Hurts. Me personally, I'm taking Justin Fields. Justin Fields, a young, improving quarterback, breaking multiple records in, in quarterback rushing and only getting better. I'm picking Justin Fields to build my franchise around. What do you, what do you say about Justin Fields can only run? Uh... Yeah, because he has no because he has no receiving court. Uh, did you? Did you? I'm sorry, but did you just say he was proven? You said he was a proven quarterback. Yes. He is not a. What did he prove? He just had zero yeah, no receiving court. Darnell Mooney. Yeah, Darnell Mooney's good. And now Chase Claypool. Moore. Yeah, now they have DJ Moore, so the Bears are gonna get better this season. But he hasn't proven anything yet. Yeah. Yeah. He's gonna I think it's too early this season. This is where he's gonna prove himself. So you're saying at 125, you're starting Justin Fields. That's your quarterback. Is Justin Fields yes. in your top seven quarterbacks? I gotta think of my top. I gotta think of my, of my top seven. Is he better than Josh Allen? No. It looks like we have a caller on the line. Yeah. Hey guys, Liam from New York, big fan of the show. Talking about all offensive players, there's a plenty of defensive players under age 25. You want to give me one of each that you think I can start a franchise around? And the Justin Fields take, I gotta disagree with. Not the best answer. I agree. You can make up with a defensive yeah. player. Thank you for calling. Yeah. I would. I think I personally would choose Micah Parsons, even though that goes very against what I believe as a Giants fan. But just seeing what Micah Parsons has done, he's just such an electric player, so I would go with Micah Parsons. Definitely agree with that one. Definitely agree with that one. I'm taking Sauce Gardner, best corner in the league. That's a good pick. Did not, did not allow any touchdowns on him. And defensive rookie of the year, and he's only getting better from here. Chris, what do you take? I think I agree with both of those choices. I don't want to disagree, but I think a very un, like an underappreciated choice would be Patrick Sertan from the quarterback Denver Broncos. I mean, he's a stud stud quarterback, but like nobody talks about him because he's on um, like I mean their defense is like pretty bad. I mean like statistically, but I think he's gonna have a breakout year this year with Russell Wilson. I Definitely agree with that one. Definitely agree. What makes you think the Broncos are gonna be better this year with Russell Wilson still in their center? Well, I feel like. Russell was the last year was like an adjustment year. I feel like in Seattle last year, he was just like, like, um, like with in Seattle before, like he was just there for so long that like he has to adjust the Broncos scheme. And um, I don't know. I feel like second year, new head coach, right? I think so. Hackett is out, so I think um, it would just be better this year. I think Hackett was not a very good coach. I agree. I agree. Yeah, the Broncos definitely improving. Javante Williams, one of the most yeah. underrated running backs, in my opinion. They have some young receivers coming into Cortland Sutton, Jerry Judy. I think he's going to be able to come up this year. A team to definitely watch out for. Well, this this will wrap it up for our segment on 69.5 Everything Sports. I'm Chase Hughes. You have our host, Chris and Eric. We'll go to commercial break. <laughs>